Yo, what's up guys? Austin More Skills Gaming. In today's video, I'm going to show you step by step how to use mods, even if you've never used a mod before. Uh, it's super easy to do. Then I'm going to show you how to back up your save file. I always recommend backing up your save file whenever using cheats or mods, just in case something were to go wrong. Now, odds are nothing's going to go wrong. Uh, people have been using mods and cheats safely for a very long time, but it never hurts to be cautious. And mods, they really are great because because they can really offer you a lot more and really give you what the game can't give you. Uh, they just really add to the experience. All right, so let's not waste any more time and let's get straight into the video. I'm gonna put on some editing magic right here and I'm gonna take you with me inside my computer. So the first thing that you're gonna wanna do before you install any mods is download BEPNX which you can get this on the Nexus Mods website. Whenever you click on a mod, it's gonna say that you're gonna need this and it'll prompt you to download this before you download any other mods. So you're gonna to wanna to have the zip file over here. So we're gonna show this in folder. Then you're gonna to wanna to extract it. I just extract it here. So the next thing you're gonna to wanna to do is drag and drop the BIP in X plus the other three files that came with it into the Dinkum folder. Now, if you need help locating your Dinkum folder, you just gotta go to your Steam app and click on Dinkum over here and go to Properties. Then go to Local Files and click Browse. And this is where your Dinkum folder will be at. All right, so now we're gonna drag and drop each uh, file over to our Dinkum folder, which was the BIP and X, uh, the changelog, the doorstep, config, and the win HTTP. And it really is that simple. Now, once you've done that, you just wanna fire up the Dinkum game and just go to quit to desktop. Now, once you've done that, just go into your BEP and X folder and you'll see a folder for plugins. Now, this is where all the mods are gonna be located and you'll need to drag each mod into the plugins folder. Now, all you gotta do is go back to Nexus Mods and search for Dinkum. As you can see, there's tons of mods that we can choose from. And I think a mod that I would really like to try out would be the Infinite Wheelbarrow mod. So let's go ahead and download that. And I usually just do the slow download. I mean, I'm not gonna pay for premium. All right, let's go ahead and extract the file. All right, now let's go ahead and drag our new mod that we downloaded over to our plugins folder. All right guys, so now I'm gonna show you how to back up your save file. All you need to do is create a new folder and you can call it save backup. Next, you'll just need to copy uh, this little user profile thing and insert it into your search bar. And I will uh, put this in the description down below. And this is where you'll find your save file. Next, you'll wanna open up your save backup folder. It'll be empty. And really it's just as simple as highlighting everything and make sure you copy because we wanna make a duplicate of our save file. We don't exactly want to move it, we just wanna duplicate it. And then just paste it in the save backup folder. And that's how you successfully back up your save. All right, so now let's test out the infinite wheelbarrow mod and kind of see how it works, right? I need to get a shovel. And I think I have my shovel in one of these boxes. Aha, shovel. And I do have a lot of wheelbarrows. All right, I am going to move this wheelbarrow somewhere that we can practice and kind of see how it works. And we should be able to put one shovel of dirt and it's gonna look full, making it infinite. So let's put it right over here and get our shovel out. All right, moment of truth. Let's go ahead and put some dirt in here. Oh wow, I think it is full. Oh, nice. That is awesome. I kind of wish I would have downloaded this so much sooner. This is a game changer for like building things and terraforming. Like this is gonna make us a terraforming beast. <laughs> I love it. All right, let's go ahead and put some sand in here and see if it's still infinite because it should be like the dirt that you last put in here. Like this would be really good to like make beaches, like custom beaches, you know? If we're making like custom beaches, this would really come in handy. All right, I'm gonna put this thing right here and I'm gonna go over to my beach. I'm gonna shovel some sand, we have some sand. Now I'm going to fly over the river 
Like Tarzan. <laughs> oh, oh wow, that's that's cool. Now we have sand. Nice. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel. I'll see you later. Peace.